Are we recording? We're recording. Good afternoon. Right, this is my first post on my YouTube channel. So it's going to only be a very, very quick, brief one, just saying hello. Um, I thought a good subject for the first one, first video, would be to talk about getting up in the morning. Um, if you don't have to be up early for work, like me, um, I start most days at five o'clock. I work in a rock climbing centre. Um, if I don't have anything to get up for, it seems very, very pointless to just get up. Um, and I find it quite hard, which means I end up just scrolling on my phone till about two o'clock in the afternoon, get up, get ready to go to work and then just go. And it seems um, to just waste my day. So this morning I tried something a little bit different and I got up out of bed at 8 a.m. Um, anyone that knows me knows that's, that's like next to impossible, especially if I'm not in work till five. Um, it helped because yesterday we adopted a new cat. So that kind of drove me to get out of bed. But the things that I did to help me from getting out of bed, uh, help me to get out of bed, were uh, I had today's clothes ready, ready to go. So fresh underwear, fresh socks, everything ready to go. Um, so all I had to do was just get out of bed and throw on my clothes. I had a bath last night, so I know I'm clean. Um, you know, fairly clean, just night sweats. That's gross. Um, you didn't know to know that. Uh, but yeah, I had a bath yesterday, so I'm pretty clean. Um, threw me clothes, that was just ready to go. And then I had a dead easy, really simple breakfast, which was just a bowl of Nesquik with some milk. So I'm up, dressed. I've eaten breakfast and it's all before nine o'clock. So absolutely buzzing. So that's my little tips for um, starting your day right. Just put some music on, have the clothes ready for you for the night before. Just get up, get dressed, open the curtains. Um, really good tip that I do actually, and I've mentioned this on my Instagram, is that when you wake up in the morning and you need to go for a toilet, right? So get out of bed, go to the toilet. Then when you come back in, get dressed, open the curtains, make your bed, and then just lie on top of the bed because then you're technically dressed and you're not technically in bed. Um, and it just makes life a lot easier. It's kind of like tricking yourself. So when you get out of bed, you've no real idea that you're not getting back in. You go to the toilet, come back, get dressed, and then that's it. Um, that might just be complete bullshit and it might not work for you. Or it might just be completely fucking obvious to just do that. But for me, uh, making getting out of bed easier easier just makes sense. Um, to anyone that's suffering today, um, or just in general, um, just take it easy. Take a nice big deep breath. Remember, you're still alive, which is a good thing, and uh, today can be whatever you want it to be. You can just read a book, or you can go out for a walk. Just do things by your own standards, and judge yourself by your own standards, and don't beat yourself up. Right, bit of a random video this for the first video on the YouTube channel. Uh, next videos to come will be interviews with other sufferers, um, sorry, not sufferers, other people who are affected by mental illness. I don't like to say suffer because it implies that people are suffering when they're not um, or living with the illness. So yeah, to come up, we'll have videos with more structure and we'll have some interviews and things like that. Uh, general idea is just to share my experiences, to hear from you guys and to see um, how we can help each other and how we can spread more awareness uh, for people who suffer from mental health. Not suffer, live with. Thank you. Bye-bye.